Hey folks, this is Rodolfo Gutierrez with Go Engineers Tech Support Engineering Squad. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to make sure your inserted parts are showing in your cut list. So I had this question pop up in tech support uh, last week, and the customer had inserted a weld outlet into a pipe, and he had a cut list, and the weld outlet was not showing up. First of all, it wasn't showing up. In the drawing view but most importantly it was not showing up in the cut list so he went back and forth and finally we did a remote session and what we found out is this the pipe is a solid body but what we discovered was that the weld outlet was a surface body which is the reason why where it wasn't showing in the drawing view and it wasn't being called out in the cut list so how do we fix that so first things first is you want to right click by the way this was this weld outlet was downloaded from McMaster car and it was downloaded as a step file the customer opened that step file saved it as a part uh, created some file properties and then inserted it into his uh, weldman part okay so that's how this came about so first things first is you want to right click on your inserted part and you want to go to editing context okay here's your part and what we need to do at the end of the day is convert this over to a solid body Okay, so the way to do that is to use the import diagnostics tool, import diagnostics tool. You can right click on your surface body on your design tree, or you can go to tools, evaluate, and then import diagnostics. Okay, so right click import diagnostics. Okay. By the way, what this does is it repairs faulty surfaces. It actually knits repaired surfaces as well into closed bodies, and it makes closed bodies into solids. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to control select your whole part if you can. It's just it grabbed all those faces and you want to hit OK. And then it'll tell you right away uh, what gaps. In this case, uh, for this weld outlet, there are no gaps and it's all good to go. So if you hit OK, you can see that it's now a an imported solid body. Okay, so if you cut, do a section view, you'll see that there is volume now. So now that this is done, okay, we'll go ahead and save it. We'll go back to our part. Okay, so it needs to rebuild. So Control Q is going to force a rebuild. And now, if we do another section view here, you'll see that it is a solid body. Okay, so let's go back to our drawing. And you see, um, it needs to rebuild. But this is this this was the issue. It wasn't showing in the cut list. So we're going to rebuild again. And there it is. Okay, so that's how you get an inserted part to show on the cut list. If it's not showing up, most likely it's a surface body. And what you need to do is you need to do everything you can to convert that over to a solid body, which will then SolidWorks will recognize and uh, and put it in your cut list. Okay, so this is Rodolfo Gutierrez. I hope this video helped you. Thank you so much. Have a great one. Bye.